the push-up. During dynamic stretching, a push-up is always a great way to warm up the upper body. We're not going to perform a lot. We'll perform three to five high-quality push-ups, slow, eccentric, to really stretch the front of the chest and anterior deltoids, and then also to challenge the core as well. So setting up in the hands and knees position, you can perform this on the knees, super slow on the way down, and then press up or with the knees off the ground, super slow on the way down, press up. You want to make sure that the elbows aren't up high or too narrow. If you look over the body, it should look like an arrow. Make sure all 10 fingers are spread apart and you're using the entire hand. You can inhale at the top of your push up, hold it on the way down, and exhale on the way up. When you're in the push-up position, you want to think that you're standing, okay? We don't want our hips forward or back. We want to think that we're in this stack position with our rib cage over our pelvis, making a 360 degree stack-like posture. Now we're going to go over the dynamic locomotor stretches. So dynamic stretching includes some strength exercises and locomotor skills. So for dynamic stretches that include locomotor skills, 